Okay, so where do we laugh? left off. We're in a very sticky wicket predicament. Um, our quarterback right here, adorable, is about to get sacked from a lineman and a back. And uh, all you need to do is put three red uh, 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 horizontal or vertical um, uh, defensive players around the ball carrier, whether it be the quarterback or uh, anyone, um, that's an automatic sack, okay? That's in the grasp. And s you can see here that they're nose to nose. During a pass, you have this guy, uh, defensive back is always facing forward that direction, and the offensive back is always facing forward in that direction. And then when you pass the ball somewhere, um, if the defensive back is nose to nose, he can go wherever you can go. One, two, three, he can go there, you know. So, the, so they're covered basically. So let's see how we can get, we, we can save this quarterback from getting sacked. Let's zoom in. Okay. So remember, okay. So I rolled a three and a five. Remember I said you can do one, two, but the, the defense doesn't usually do it, but you can see how good it works for the offense. And then you have a three um, or a five for your lineman. Um, I like this guy because he's slowing that guy down because I'm going to come over here somewhere. Okay, so I go one, two, and then three back here, right? And that's done for the lineman. And now the backs, the quarterback's just going to... Pull on my horn. One, two, three. Um, this well, this guy can go, and this is another good reason to have this marker. You can go one, two, three. See where the other guy can go, right behind you. You may want to take this guy and put him here. And you can see, by the way, the pieces get automatically rearranged whether you move them or not. But sometimes it's nice to move them so you know which direction you're blocking as the quarterback moves, the blocking moves because the offensive linemen are always have their main back to the quarterback and then they have the half, which is a full block and a half block on this direction. This guy has half, uh, this guy has a full block here and uh, this is, this offensive lineman is blocking this guy one X, you might say, and this is a half X, a half X, uh, half block, so he can go one, two this way, or one, two, you know, whatever. Anyway, okay. Uh, no, no uh, player piece of the same type can can be in the same uh, grid space. You can have two uh, the opponents there, but you can't have two blues or two reds. Okay. So that's a pretty good move. So I did one, two, three, and uh, and now out of my five, I did one, two, three. And now I'm going to make a run for it. This guy can go one, two. Um, I can come up and get help from him. Um, I've already crossed the line of scrimmage. You can see, well, you can't see over there, but this is the line of scrimmage. And then um, let's see what we're going to do. Very, very interesting. I got four or five. Um, I could close off this. So this guy's messed up. Or I can run this way and see if I can block for him. Or I can have this guy come around. Let me see. And if this guy, if we get, if he hit, if he has a double, if the defense gets a double, he'll go one, two, three. But he he can't uh, go diagonally with that extra point. He he needs two extra points to get me because of this blue guy forces him to go around and not use a shortcut. Okay, so I'm gonna do that. Yeah, I'm gonna, uh, so I got two more and I'm gonna, I'm gonna, well, I could go one, two, give him, try to give him a hand. Go one, two here, yeah. I think I'll have this guy give him a hand. Trying to block him so he can run around. Well, don't want to tell my opponent myself. Keep that to yourself. Okay, five and two. 
Now he's crossed the, if you zoom out, you can see the, the marker is at the 20 yard line. So he's crossed the 20 yard line. So we're running now. He's a, he's a running back, the quarterback. And um, so the defense gets a five and a two. Can you see that right here? Okay, five and a two. And what's he gonna do? What will he do? This guy wants to go one, two, one, two, three for sure. Well, he can see he's gonna get closed off pretty fast. This guy wants to come up one, two, three. He comes straight up. Vroom. Again, that's a good use for your marker. This holds the ball, but it also goes one, two, three, figures out how far you can go, how far this guy can go. One, two, three. You you don't have to think about the shortcuts. You can just count horizontal and vertical. Um, so I definitely want to block him and just, how about just straight up the middle? That's the smart way to do it. Let's move you up a little bit. Let's give you a, a good blimpy, blimpy view here. Um, I'm going to do exactly that. I'm going to go one. Wait a second. The defense goes now, dummy. Five and a two. Five and a two. What am I going to do? I'm going to run up one, two, three, and I'm going to go right into the block or, yes, definitely one, and get too much, but two. Could go here. No, I need the strength for my backs here. They're faster. So this guy can go one, two. He cannot go three. Remember, he's facing this direction. Well, no, hold on. This is a running play. This is not a passing play. Passing play, during a pass, he would be facing this way, but now, since the ball crossed the, uh, the uh, line of scrimmage, we have a block zone everywhere is block zone, which means you can go anywhere you want. I mean, um, it's, it's free for all. You can go wherever you want. You're going for the ball, obviously. So let me see, one, two, three. One, two, three. Yeah, I like that. One, two, three. And we already used our two. And four, five. Four, five. I'm gonna go into this block. This is now a block, by the way. And um, you cannot block from these three directions because he is always facing forward when going into a block. And these guys are always facing that way. Except when they're in the same line as here, then they're facing towards the quarterback. All right. Or if they're here, then this guy is facing. He's facing that way, or he can face that way, either way. All right, uh, so I did one, two, three, four, five, and that's it, okay. Now, offense goes. Now it's gonna be more interesting. Um, Since the quarterback's here, I can only push him here, here, or here. Since the quarterback's here, I can only push this guy over here, 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 or here. If I push him here, one, two, These two guys are, yeah, that's good. One, two, and this guy. This guy's doing good blocking this guy. 
so I'm gonna leave him here, but this guy's facing me and I can block him from this side. I can't block him from this side because that would be an illegal block from behind. You see, he's facing the ball. Okay, good, nice. So that's three. And um, this guy is only blocking this one and this guy is blocking these three. So these two blocks don't add up. This is a free block. This is only a quarter of a block. It doesn't stop anybody. So he can go one, two, three, or three. And then I have a four. Or I can do one, just one. Two, one, two, three, four. And this guy can't block me from these two, three directions. Okay, very nice. Okay. Let's see if the blue can get out of it. So far, we've got 10, 20 yards. Let's just try to get as many yards as we can. Okay, I don't know if you can see that. That's a five and a one. Okay. And now, we're in a sticky, wicky, predicament. I cannot block that guy. These are his, the ba his backs. And his backs are this direction. One, two, three, can't block him. Can't get out of this one. All I can do is go one, two, three, run right into him. That's all I can do. Well, one, two, three. Someone smarter out there can probably think of a better move, but that's all I can think of. I can run right into the, this back and get automatically tackled. And then when we zoom out, you can see this marker right here, this red one, gets moved all the way over to this line right here because this, take everything else away, this is where the football crossed, right here. It crossed this line. So you can't get credit for the next line, obviously. So you cross this line, and we gained 10, 20, 30, 40, 50 yards. So if you want to play the quick scoring, I can automatically go 50 yards, and... Um, you can play for just one down or two down at the beginner level. Sometimes you could just start off by playing two downs and then in that case, then the red the red team, I mean just one down, in that case, then the red team would go. So you get, uh, I'm sorry, that's the wrong side. This is the blue side, 50, you get 50. And the red team as zero, but that's okay because all, both teams, we have what's called drive innings. Both teams have a chance to go the same amount of times at offense. And you just start at the 20 yard line, there's no kick. We do actually have a kickoff method, but that's very advanced and it's, uh, it's not necessary to play this game. This game is a strategy game. And give up the football to the red, and the red has it on the 20 yard line. Now you may notice that the end zones are kind of big relative to the, to the field. Well, this really isn't a 100 yard field. It says it's 100 yards, but it's really 10 yards approximately, or 20 depending on the, on, on the version of football, whether you're playing from the middle out or playing like we're playing from 20 yard line. <clears throat> so this is 10 yards from here to here. And we just got uh, 50 yards from the 20 to here, and we got 50 points, okay? 
Now, uh, the long version is you have to score a touchdown to get 10 points. You get the 80 yards plus two bonus, okay? Anyway, so that would be a long three-hour game, but we don't need to worry about that. Right now, this is just, I'm teaching you just a quick way to play. In any case, it would be the same thing. You would, uh, first, the offense would line up. You can have a, a, a running back here, or you can have all his guys lined up right along the line, like this, all squashed together. And um, you can uh, play it safe over here. One, two, three. We lose, oh, here we go. And four. <clears throat> And we can let those guys by <clears throat> and see if we can rush the quarterback. And the quarterback can decide to go on the shotgun formation at the last minute. That's no problem. And now we'll zoom in on here. And we'll start again. When he's done, if he has 50 points, then or if he scores a touchdown, he automatically wins because that's the if he gets if he scores a touchdown, that's 80 points plus 20. Uh, bonus for the touchdown, then he gets uh, the blue, uh, the, the red side gets 100 first, and they both had an equal chance in, uh, at offense, which is called a drive inning. So, anyway, we start from here, and you can see that in the next video. Thank you very much.